Hi guys, welcome back. It's me, Joy's Love, the number one empress, and I'm here to do Scorpio's oracle reading. Okay, how you guys doing, my gods and goddesses? I would appreciate if you guys like, subscribe, comment, and share. Hit the bell on the side for all the updated videos when I post them. If you're like a personal reading or donate to the channel, the information will be in the description box below. Check it out. Um, let's get into this reading. God, so spirit, I ask that you come into me and let me say your words and not my own so that I can give my Scorpios, my gods and goddesses, the best reading possible, as accurate as possible. Thank you, Spirit. Amen. Now let's see what's on and popping <laughs> with my Scorpios. Okay, so I, with the Scorpios, I'm feeling some energy of, like, um, Like losing your breath or something. Um, I don't know. Um, it'll come to me, but it's like you guys have to slow down and take a deep breath and just sit there for a minute. Okay? So that I'm seeing a lot of green here from the Oracle. Okay? Yeah, bottom on the deck before Earth. Okay. So, right now, Scorpios, you have the nine of Earth. Enjoying life, little luxuries. Spending quiet time alone. Success, successful self-employment. So, this is like, you know, everything your wish is being fulfilled. It's like spirit is saying... It's time for you to relax. It is time for you to, you know, sit back and be in your gratitude energy of, you know, being in a flow of accepting so that you, it's, it's, it's on its way. You planted a lot of beautiful seeds and now it's time for your harvest time. Okay, Scorpios, it's time for the harvest time. So it's like, you know, be grateful for the little things in life. When you, you know, when you alone, reflect on what you have and what you want. You know, thank you, God, so a spirit for every little thing. And it's like everything is, you know, you touch, you're going to have the mightiest touch. You got it. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, be confident in yourself and know that it's your time. Know that you've done you've done the work. And God's so spirit is ready to, you know, um, give you what it is that you desire. Okay? You also have, and it's also green, okay? So this is dealing with your heart chakra, you know, um, learning to let go a little bit of the control of trying to block yourself and putting yourself in a space of the flow, being in a flow, opening your heart chakra up and radiating all of that beautiful love you, um, my Scorpios, we have it. It's time to, you know, put it out there. You have another green card, too, and this is the page of Earth. Scholarly, dependable, patient, successful. Good news about financial matters. Wanting to do something more challenging, a new area of study. So this is just saying, you know, you know, dig deep into your spirituality. Once again, opening up your heart chakra, you know, just standing in your power, being confident enough to know that you have done the work that it takes and that, you know, you're just, you know, ready to put yourself out there on a new, this new venture that you're going on, leveling up. And you just, you know, you know, being confident in yourself because you know, that everything is gonna be all right. Your your financial means everything is going the way it's supposed to be going. And I did want to say to one of you guys, you know, a couple of you, half of you, well, the majority of you Scorpios, that um, if you're thinking about doing some type of entrepreneurship or you know, like starting a business or investing in something, it's the time to go for it. It's the time to go for it because you know everything is you know falling in alignment with you. You. So it's time to put yourself out there and do the thing that you, you know, has been a little fearful of doing. It's time to do it. It's time to do it. Okay? And you have the Queen of Air. 
This is dealing with like your throat chakra, I'm thinking, independent, experienced, realistic, witty, objective decision, decision making, clearing away all that no longer serves you, seeing the human in a situation. So this is saying, you know, you got the world at your disposal, you know, at the palm of your hands, and it's time for you to make things go your way. It's time for you to um, go out there and be realistic on your dreams and goals and go for them. It's time for you to experience new things. It's time for you to know that you don't, that you only have you. That you, it's time for you to move about. You don't need no one to help you do none of this. Or and it's time for you to get back to yourself. It's Expressing your creativity, you know, speaking your mind. It's time to do it and not taking life so serious. Seeing the human in every situation, okay? Standing in your higher power, knowing who you are, moving accordingly. Like, okay, you funny. I see you. You funny. <laughs> okay? And you have the fourth earth. Being too um, cautious or being too cautious with money. Great business decisions. Giving to those less fortunate. And that's the fourth earth. So, it's like you, it, it don't worry, Scorpios. You know, don't worry. Know that God's so spirit have your back. Whoever you pray to. The, the energies around you. Is you all in you in alignment? Everything that that have happened to you to this point is the divine way of doing things. So don't worry about your money senses. You know you got resources that's there for you. It's time for you to reach out. It's time for you to let go of the worry, and it's time for you to enjoy yourself, putting yourself in a um uh, a different mind state. You know what I'm saying? Seeing things different. A different perspective on what it is. This is not happening to me. This is happening for me. For me to stand up in my power. For me to know who I am. For me to get get out and get it. For me to, you know, think positive so I can attract all of the abundance that I have in store for me. Me having faith knowing that I have done an amazing job. Okay, Scorpios, you have done an amazing job. You have been dying and coming back and dying and coming back. Um, you're digging deep within your spirituality. You're going um, deep. You go, you have went deep, Scorpio. Can't nobody go as deep as you. So it's time for you to know and be confident in yourself that I did this. Now it's time for me to party. Party. Okay, so let me give you another oracle. Thank you, Spirit, for this message. Just don't take life too serious, okay? So you have the, the you have the nine of Michael, okay? This is your worry is unnecessary. Focus your thoughts on the outcome you desire. Release feelings of regret, guilt, or worry to your angels. It's time for you to have faith. It's time for you to show that you trust in the energies. And it's time for you to let go of those unnecessary worries that you have. Listening to your intuition. Praying about your situations. Giving it over to the angels and letting it go. Okay? It, it's time with the nine of Michaels there. It's time. Because it's time to level up. It's time to be more creative. It's time to get out there and show the world who you really are. Scorpios, it's that time. And Spirit is saying, knock, knock, knock. Are you going to let me in? Are you going to let me assist you? Come on, let's do the damn thing. Look at this. Divine guidance. Number five. I can't make it up. Archangel Sanifon. The search for meaning in life. Consider an, altern consider an alternative approach. Surround yourself with wise teachers and friends. It's time. You got it's time. The number five is here too. So it's like you have to, you know, listening to your inner intuition, praying about your situations, knowing that there's a new beginning coming your way. Change is coming. Okay? Um, spirit is letting you know that they are there for you. They are wanting you to speak speak to them more and to um, steal your mind, steal yourself. 
take a walk in nature, um, whatever it takes for you to, you know, get into some um, a long time so that you can listen to that inner voice and you can move accordingly and make the right choices for your happiness, Scorpio. All right. And let's get one more. Oracle for my Scorpios, what do you have to tell them? You have to say, through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. Oh, and I just talked about that. Prayer and meditation to steal your mind. I don't know, you guys can't see it. screenshot it do something but yes it is time so you gotta listen to your intuition with this purple here it's time for you to dig deeper listen listen a little bit more pray a little bit more meditate a little bit more because it's time for you to level up it's time for you to get it and you gotta be ready for it are you ready scorpios are you ready because it's here it's here well, this was your reading. This is what the oracle wanted you to know. So, and, um, yeah, yeah. So, this is what, this is what it is. And please subscribe, subscribe, subscribe. Thank you guys for being patient with me. I'm still, you know, in the midst of moving and doing all of this and that. Um, but I'm still trying to get y'all something out there. So, good luck with everything, Scorpios. Um, I love you guys. You guys got this, Okay. And it's just, you know, take your time, love, 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 listening to the intuition, moving accordingly, and getting your blessings. All right? Um, subscribe, subscribe, like, and all of that good stuff. Until next time, you guys, be safe, wash your hands, and be sanitized, all that good stuff there. Peace out.